24-year-old Steve Judy is, by his own admission, a misfit. He is also a man eager to die. In and out of jail for the past 11 years, Judy faults society for what he has become. Most of his crimes have involved women. He admits committing up to 13 rapes since he was 12 years old. And Judy believes his victims are to blame. The women are gullible. All women? All that I've met. Judy met Terry Lee Chastine and her three small children the morning of April 28, 1979. On that day, Judy admits he abducted them, drove them to this Indiana Creek, where he raped and strangled the woman, and when the children cried, threw them into the water to drown. Now, hours before his own death, Judy still has no regrets. I just don't think about it. Judy's execution will be the fourth in this country in five years. Gary Gilmore was killed by a Utah firing squad in 1977. John Spinkelink was electrocuted in Florida in 1979. Later that same year, Jesse Bishop died in a Nevada gas chamber. Today, there are 731 people on death row in 33 states. Unlike Judy, most don't want death. I'm not sorry for the things I've done because I've lived my, my life the only way I knew how. And I'm just kind of glad it's over with now. Jim Hickey, ABC News, Michigan City, Indiana.